up my friends how are we welcome back to yet another video today we look at Bobby Wagner number 29 on the list of the top 100 NFL players of 2022 he's always there or thereabouts he's an absolute he's an absolute beast I'm not gonna lie he's a linebacker listed as playing for the Rams although we haven't actually seen him suit up for them yet um, he was a Seahawk so was Russell Wilson as we can see on screen Wilson's gone to the Broncos Wagster has gone to the Rams what are we going to hear from the big man, Russ Wilson, about his uh, defensive behemoth, Bobby Wagner? Let's see. What makes Bobby so special is his consistency. And I think that consistency shows up every day. No one wants to play in snow. It's amazing, the productivity from Bobby. He'll go down as one of the best linebackers to ever play this game. consistent Bobby Wagner he's still you know doing what he's doing so you got to give him respect there that's the thing I think he came in the league in like 2013 and with that in mind let's look up his stats Nick Minnett. Bobby Wagmeister aka Bobby <laughs> oh shit sorry guys I actually wrote in Bobby Wagster <laughs> uh, look am I laughing at my own jokes or I don't know anyway Bobby Joseph Wagner Born July June 27th, 1990. He's 32 years of age. Six foot even, 242 pounds. Running round out there like an absolute beast. Pick number 47, round number two of the 2012 draft. Been at the Seahawks since being drafted in 2012 to 2021, which means a 10-year career. And he's just been traded or entered the free agency. We will look at that. I will look at that because, you know, a guy who's been at a team for 10 years and then goes and uh, signs with another team. Not only do I want to know the actual, the money behind it, the, 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 the financials behind the deal, but I also want to know how it came about. So with all that in mind, um, you know, he's a Super Bowl champion. He's a six-time first-team All-Pro participant selection. In 2014, 2016, 2017, 2018, 2019, and 2020, and he made the second team all pro in the two seasons he didn't make it in 2015 and 2021. So he's always been up there. He's an eight time pro bowler every single fucking year from 2014 to 2021. Two time NFL tackles leader. So uh, yeah, look, you ain't getting past him. I'll say that much. I don't know how he tackles and I'm not sure if it's a, a targeting type. I'm not sure if it's a, an arm tackle. I'm not even sure if it's, uh, if it's legal. But he tackles them. And he's got 1,383 tackles in his career. That is the most we've seen thus far. That is ridiculous. He runs a 40-yard dash in 4.46 seconds, which means he could play on either side of the ball. Doesn't matter what position he's playing. He's going to be elite. 39 and a half inches vertical jump, 11-foot broad jump, 24 reps on the bench. This is the most impressive athlete we've seen thus far. Not a doubt in my mind. And if we have a look at how many games he's played, 151 games, 1,383 combined tackles 23 and a half sacks 68 tackles for loss 60 passes deflected 11 interceptions with a return of 98 yards for a touchdown in 2018 six forced fumbles nine fumble recoveries and three touchdowns off of those fumble recoveries the, the last of which came in 2017 so he hasn't scored a touchdown for a fair while, but that doesn't mean he hasn't been an absolute dynamite player out there, which he indeed has. He's played 16 career postseason games, not including last year, unfortunately. Seattle didn't make it. But uh, look, the man is absolutely everywhere, and I will say, he might have been in the league for 10 years, but he hasn't slowed down. He recorded his career high career season high 170 combined tackles last year in 16 games he's he, he he hasn't had a year with less than 100 tackles and the only reason he even got close is because he only played 11 games in 2014 he got 104 combined tackles when he plays the full season he's 100 plus tackles no doubt now if we look at his deal Following the 2021 season, Wagner was named second team All-Pro, yep, we got that, on March 9th, 2022, a short four months ago. Five months. He was released after 10 seasons with the Seahawks. Now, I'm not sure why that was, but 
He signed a five-year contract worth up to $65 million with the Los Angeles Rams on March 31st, 2022. He's 32. He signed a five-year deal. He may well see out his career with the Rams. And uh, if he does, he might even get the elusive career combined tackle amount of 2000 you know what i probably did this last year i can't remember but i have to look up nfl career combined tackle leaders let's have a look who is leading the nfl in tackles no no oh sorry nfl nfl all time what we got here oh my god ray lewis 1500 1568 is that combined or solo let's have a look i'm assuming it's solo actually Where's Wagster? Hang on, let's have a look at his, um, let's go back here. What do we got? We've got solo, 819 solo tackles. There might be, they, they most probably are counting total tackles as solo tackles, which would make sense, I guess. 819. Where is he? Where is he? There he is. Bobby Wagster, a.k.a. Bobby Wagner. 819, 29th on the list at the moment. So they don't really count combined tackles as far as tackle leaders, which, you know, uh, kind of pisses me off, I'm not going to lie. But Ray Lewis leads that, 1,568 tackles. Oh my God. Oh my God, what a pleasure it would have been to see him play. What a pleasure it would have been. But there we go, Bobby Wagster. You know, another good season. He might actually overtake the likes of Eric Weddle, Brian Dawkins, and Rodney Harrison. Only time will tell. Let's go, Bobby. But when I say about that true relentless effort, he's a monster. What a play by the all-pro middle linebacker. Bobby Wagner! You know, at this stage, he'd be pissed off if it was a combined tackle. Like, leave it to me, mate. He's always been one of the best to do it since he came in the league, and he's a ball hawk as well. Bobby Wagner with a great job on coverage. He's physical, fast. He can do it all. That boy Bobby putting on a clinic at linebacker. He could go around you. Wagner wraps Look at that. Middle linebacker, you know. Just exactly the same as Ray Lewis. Captain of the defense. Just watching. Waiting. Firing. Up and brings him down. Oh, he could go through you. This is a heck of a play by Bobby Wagner. When you have that type of linebacker, you got to give a lot of respect to. Especially with, with seeing how you're going to attack him and block him. Also, a guy that could drop back and catch interceptions. For the some thing, reason, man, the he's, he's, the thing is, I, I, look, I don't know if he's still, after 10 years in the league, I don't know if he can still clock a 4-4-5 40-yard dash, but he's got the speed. Something that just comes he's out got of the him. speed to do if, anything. I'm on the sideline, I got to watch it every time. He's just popping out in zone coverage in the window. All right, let's have a look. And Jimmy didn't see him, and he, he catches the first one of the season. What a play by Bobby Wagner. Ball awareness. You know, just little things like that. He always just shows up when he plays us. Let's go. Time to get a stop. He's a guy that I love playing against. I think he does all. We haven't seen George Kittle on this list since the first video. They're bringing him back in slowly but surely because he's he's bound to be in the top 20. I don't mind seeing George Kittle, but what I will say is that, geez, it's been a while. All the little things right. He's flying around the field every single time. Great play by Bobby Wagner. You're going to have two guys on him. He's Hang on. Hang on, he's got a tackle and a guard. He's got one arm on each. What's going to happen here? Still going to figure out a way to make the play. Bobby Wagner comes up to stick a shoulder pad into Gibson's chest. Future Hall of Famer. He's always there and he's always making plays. Hey, they don't score. No points. Hey, no points. He's one of those guys that, you know, the older he gets, it's almost like the better he, he gets. He's a very good player and you always know where he is for sure. <laughs> He's a phenomenal from the time he came in as a rookie to now. Just a smart player, uh, always in the right spot, you know, making plays in the backfield. He's so fast and so disruptive. You gotta take at least a piece off of the guy. It's fast. Bobby Wagner is fast. He is Not fast. Just fast, but furious. In the past decade, no player has taken down a ball carrier more than all pro linebacker Bobby Wagner. Bobby Wagner, a do it all middle linebacker, one of the best to ever play this game. In 2021, he recorded over 100 tackles for the 10th straight season. That's what I'm saying, man. Every season. 
a streak he'll look to continue as a Los Angeles Ram. I think he's one of the best players to ever play this game at that position, and uh, just his ability to go get the quarterback. Jeez, what a pickup. What a pickup for the Rams. Oh, they're looking good this year again, aren't they? And go get the ball carrier. He's a force. What a play by number 54. I always tell him that I have much respect for his game. I love competing against him because I feel like he's one of the best in the game and he's been doing it for a long time. Hey. I've been coaching 10 years at linebacker the NFL, man. It's Thank always you. a pleasure to watch you Thank play, you. man. Thank you're, you. You're a Hall of Famer. Tremendous play. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate you it. Thank you. Not bad. Not bad at all. All right, I won't keep you too much longer, guys. In the next video, we'll look at Quentin Nelson, a.k.a. Mr. Pancake Block. I'm led to believe. Um, loves to paint the under eye area with the NFL paint. I'm not quite sure what that's called. I did get I did get sent a, a little bottle of it actually by a friend of mine, Al, back in the day. Uh, never used it, but um, certainly certainly creates a, a, a certain look. You know, a certain look, especially around these these big boppers, these guys who are going down in the trenches every single game, and that's what guards do, and that's what Quentin Nelson's doing. But anyway, this this video was about um, Bobby Wagster, Bobby Wagner, the Wagmeister, and uh, look, uh, will I back the Rams this year? No, no, I'm not going to. I've got four teams, four teams: Jags, Bucks, Dolphins. What was the other one? Look, we'll call it at three. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.